Well, it's one of those places where it, as soon as you walk in and the door closes behind you, you can kind of imagine you're in New Orleans. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. the whole atmosphere of the place from the huge bar, the dark wood, the, the big lion's head above the bar, um, all the artwork around, um, the great music. They're always playing blues or jazz or something very New Orleans. And the food is just really simple, excellent New Orleans style food. Very spicy. Um, they have a great bar too. They have 24, usually 24 hard to find microbrews on tap behind the bar. They have a, um, a porch out on the side. You can sit on the patio mm -hmm. and dine out there if you'd like or just inside and it's, it's really nice. They have some intimate booths with big overstuffed chairs you can sit in. Um, or just sit at the bar and eat a bowl of gumbo if you want. Uh, trying to find the place was kind of difficult. It was. Yeah, it was. Uh, but I agree with him with the food. The food was wonderful. I had the soft shell crab, what they're known for, with the pecans and the uh, blackened butter. Mm. It was superb. I, I really enjoyed it. It was excellent. Um, I wanted the uh, sweet potato brulee, but they didn't have it. I was a little pissed about that. But <laughs> of course, you can't have everything. Uh, the chairs were nice and comfortable. The dining areas, they needed a little bit more lighting. Now, I find the lighting was a little bit too dark. But yeah, for, for a twenty-dollar prix fix menu, three yeah. courses. Mm -hmm. You know, I had a fabulous appetizer, crab meat mornay, which is you know big chunks of crab and yeah. this creamy sauce with cheese on the top. Oh, I loved it. Okay. And then uh, <laughs> I had their doorstop pork chop. I, I love the gumbo. It's it's hard to find a really good seafood gumbo with crawfish and and everything else in there, and they make a really good one. Let's not forget the red beans and rice. Oh, yeah. Oh, they were so soulful. <laughs> I think it's one of those places that it's it's just a complete getaway. Like I said, when the door closes yeah. behind you, you're in New Orleans. You That's sure how you are. feel. The backwoods. You know, Orleans. and you're never rushed. The drinks are excellent. The food is just delicious. And if you still have room, the desserts are great. I enjoyed myself. The atmosphere was nice and warm. And like I said, they just need to lighten it up a little bit. It's kind of dark in there. I will be going back.